<coughs> Remember this for later, this crack right here. Now this is a card shop. What is this supposed to do? Hello, welcome to the they fit on cards first time here. Right ho, right ho. Available for purchase today we have card bags and catch cards. A card bag is a little snapshot that holds a single filled cat's card. You won't know the character on it until you purchase it. Oh, blah, 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 I know how they work. Oh, I get it already! No! Fuck you! At least give me a little warning. I don't care! No! I don't want to hear it again! You're a dick. Uh huh. Um, uh. Eight blocks each color once. Remember that for later. All right. The whole eight blocks each color once thing. Remember that for later. Now, uh, let us enter the next world. <coughs> Peach is going to be real important in this level. Well, Act 4 anyway. Mario and his new friends open the door, unsure of what they would find. All the while, Marley's words about finding the other two heroes rang in their minds. Were these other heroes somewhere in this new world? If not, where? Meanwhile, the creepy void grew larger and the skies above flip side. The hopes of all worlds rested on the heroes finding the next pure heart. Chapter 3 1! When Geeks Attack! The Bitland, Act 1. The Bitland. Ugh, Geeks. Yes! We're going old school. The land of digitalness. Where everything is digital. Back in those old days. It's all retro, pixelated, and whatnot. You're actually going to find three pixels in this world. <laughs> so this is where that door leads. I suppose the next to your heart must be nearby. That's odd. I can feel it nearby, but where could it be? You'll know why... Well, we'll like beat the boss, of course. You'll know why it's far away, but also very nearby. Where could it be? Well, I... Ah! Technical! I caught a super rare pixelated butterfly! My friends at DaisyButter.ner are going to freak when they get one of this find! I must bring it home, I can't miss this week's episode of the Grotus Chronicles! No way am I going to trust my digital recorder mail to tape an episode so epic! This is so high technical! Weirdo. Tippy is gone. We lost her. Oh ho ho! A kidnapping! Oh, this bad! The awful spectacle of it all! The shocking scene occurred right before my very own tender eyes! Well, I guess that's the wrap for that pixel! Now that that freak Francis has got her! The Bitlands. Nah, probably nothing. Okay! Every just about everything's pixelated here. Notice how these Koopas aren't wearing sunglasses! Or, you'll know why later. Because if you're if Kimba was possessed, they'd be wearing sunglasses. But these guys aren't. You'll know why. Oh. What is up here? Oh, right. Right, that's right. I thought we had to go down the pipe. Oh, a catch card! Catch cards are like Pokeballs. They either work or they don't. Well, that is how Pokeballs are supposed to work. As far as I know. They either, either they work or they don't work. So... 
yeah. If it's if it's a weakling, it might work. There's a good chance it'll work, but if it's a bit stronger, there's a chance it's gonna fail big time. I'll get me that catch card and maybe demonstrate for you. Catch card SP. Oh yeah, there's different kinds of catch cards, like Pokeballs. A catch card SP is one that will almost always work. Just like Pokeballs, there are Ultra Balls and Premium Balls, or whatever you call them, and Master Balls. I forget what the strongest kind of Pokeball was. You know, that acquaintance I mentioned told me countless times, I actually forgot. Um, I know Master Ball is supposed to be, like, really strong. Oh my god, Peach, you take forever to become giant and invincible, and then, hurry up already, hurry it up already, yeah, you can't fall down them holes because you're a big fat ass, yeah. <laughs> <coughs> Oh, I like this part. It's awesome. The Invincible Koopa Troopa! Holy crap, holy crap, oh, holy crap, holy crap. Giant Koopa Troopa, Invincible Koopa, Koopa Troopa, ma, 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 ma. He's Invincible! Retro Koopa Troopa! I go Mario. Holy crap, holy crap. <laughs> now I'm invincible! Koop is bigger than Mario. <laughs> Simple as that. My invincible is stronger. Far in between the red pipes. Simple as that. How could anyone have a hard time reading something as simple as that? Fall in between the red pipes. If you can't read something as simple as that, then you must be a three-year-old or something. <laughs> By the way, this place is actually optional, it feels like your first playthrough. Because you can just fall in between those red pipes without having to go and read that. After all, it is a simple reading thing. I only got six health left? Yikes. I'm gonna eat something. It's my help. <laughs> Blah. Now there's an ice storm over there. Oh, it's a match Koopa! Koopa! There's an enemy over here that is su that is super annoying. Nice. That thing well no you don't. That is a Curosia that will send you to flip side within an instant. And he had to come all the way back here again. It's called a back cursia, and I caught him. Yeah! I caught a back cursia! What? Come on, respond! What the? What? Uh, oh, 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 I forgot, I don't have Tippy with me. 
Do I actually forgot I didn't have Tippy. 